It's 24 past 10. I am watching Viva Fry. Now, there is a segue here that I'm pert pertaining to, alluding to. I'm not sure if those are, both of those words are either correct here in this situation, but Viva Fry, he is a YouTuber who we've interviewed this week on CreatorCast, and that episode has now gone live. Check it out here. If you've ever seen the video that I first saw of his was the drone fishing, what is it called? It's called Insane, Insane Drone Fishing Bass. Well, I'll tell you what it's called because I'm on his channel right now. It's called, da -da 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 date added, no, I need to go most popular. His video is called Drone Bass Fishing Insane Must Watch. <laughs> That's a little bit of a clickbaity title, but it is a really funny video. And if you've never seen that, you definitely should check out the Creator Cast video I linked to earlier because we do, we, Danny and I dig deep onto how that video came about and the, the, the backstory, if you like. And Viva Fry, David Fryheit, he's a very nice guy. He's someone that I really look up to and I really enjoy watching his content. And I was just watching this extra one he's done here. Well, not extra, it's in his back catalog. Uh, lawyer Vlogger, because he's, he's an ex-lawyer. or well, he's still a lawyer. Lawyer Vlogger's analysis of Casey Neistat's interview with Logan Paul in parentheses, parentheses, parentheses <laughs> body language. And that's really, really informative. If you... If you look at the way people talk with their body and how Logan was defensive and how he might not have been telling exact truths, Viva Fry digs deep into that and explains how and why because he's a he's a lawyer. He knows he knows how people react and how they answer and how they probably avert questions somewhat cunningly. Let's just leave it at that. Now, the other news, a small update on the Kingpin. <laughs> We're calling it the Kingpin snorkel mask situation. So I've sent forward my suggestions of everyone that's applied. By the way, everyone who applied, thank you so much. And now applications are closed. And I've put forward who I think would be suitable from that massive list to my guy. And then what I'm doing now is waiting on him getting back to me. And I'm trying to be as transparent with you guys as possible. So, so you always see where we are with this process. Right now, as of today, the email has gone to my guy. And when he gets back to me with his response, then I will formulate a massive burp. <laughs> I will formulate a massive a general email to all 10 successful applicants. Uh, it'll be a blind CC, so you won't see the other people, but it will be the same email everyone will get and, and CC'd on that email will, will be my guy. So then you guys get introduced to my guy and he gets introduced to you through me. <laughs> and hence the word kingpin. Um, that may take two or three days, let's be honest. My guy might not get back to me at all at this point. I mean, when I say at all, I mean today. It's Sunday and uh, he's in Europe, so it's a day behind. Um, maybe it might take Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday or something before I have a further update. But I do want to keep everybody on the down low as informed as possible as to what's going on with that. And just to also let you know that it's all closed. So if you didn't get in earlier, 